this ain't no Aaliyah's face, but it's definitely Sebastian Joyce. So. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sebastian Joyce. If you are new here, hello and welcome. Period. Today is Friday the 29th of December. Praise the Lord. The last Friday of the year. God, thank you. Thank you, God, for getting me this far. Thank you, God, for seeing me through a whole year. Guys, why is it always whenever I come to vlog, like I'm always looking crusty AF? Like it's always giving crustyana. Look at my face breaking out. I just started my period, guys. Like it's a lot, all this prepping and stuff. It's a lot. Like I'm, it's a lot. I'm going through it. It's a lot it's actually a lot but anyways welcome back guys so as you can see by the title of this video this is a holiday prep i did put a poll on um youtube community and i asked you guys to tell me like what kind of video you wanted to see more of almost 100 percent of the people that voted said that they wanted to see more lifestyle um vlogs from me so that's what i'm gonna do um i don't think vlogs do really well on my channel but i'm going to try do more of them and hopefully you know you guys enjoy it more girls going on holiday i say holiday but it's just a quick city break with my girls for new years ooh, ooh, i've never gone away for new years except like back home in angola um we spent new years last year with my dad in angola and i think that's the first time ever i've actually spent new years away out of england other than obviously when i was a child this is exciting like being in a different city for new years like come on like let's go like starting off the year strong starting off the year as i mean to go on because i'm gonna travel okay this year i'm gonna travel 2024 i'm traveling i'm not gonna tell you guys where we're going yet um you'll find that out in the next vlog and vlog and vlog um but yeah i have a few things to do i have a few things to settle to do before i feel like ready and complete for this holiday it is only a two-day break so it's like not even that serious it's not that deep but i ain't been away this whole year so i really want to enjoy my two days away in a different country on the checklist for this holiday prep is nail fix so i've actually already done my nails um i literally just left my nail appointment now i had two fingers to fix two of these and one of my thumbs my other thumb has got a little crack in it but she didn't have time to fix that so hopefully it's okay just for these two days but i feel like my nails have like really been breaking lately i think it's the length i think my nails don't like being so long i think they prefer being a little bit shorter so i might have to cut down the lips next time but anyways i've actually already done my nails i love my nail tech i love getting my nails done i love my gel sets like i love like my whole biab journey and like grow my nails and like i love love it i absolutely love it so i had to go get them fixed ready for my holiday they're looking so cute look at them so cute next on the list is go get my brows done so i just want to fix them up because they're looking a little bit messy right now and i feel like when my brows are not done like i'm more prone to like look scruffy and ugly like i feel like i get more texture on my skin it's so weird i'm also gonna take the chance to go into boots and get my lip gloss from nyx my is it creme brulee because i lost it and i need it so i need to go get that and i don't know whether boots do huda beauty but i'll check if they do huda beauty if so i'm going to buy a little mini version of the um loose powder because mine is literally it's going it's going going gone so i need to buy those two things hopefully they're in stock fingers crossed i also need to wash my hair guys i need to redo my convict braids like my wig braid aunt is home so she's going to do that for me so i just need to wash my hair i've got some new products from plant made i'm gonna tap into that tonight or tomorrow night i don't know yet guys i don't know how tonight is gonna plan out because i haven't even finished cleaning what i was cleaning before i left the house i've got a lash appointment tomorrow i need to go pick up my dress tomorrow because i bought my new year's dress and i bought it from house cb i bought it in a size 10 which i believed i now am but it just doesn't fit me the way i wanted it to fit so i took it to the seamstress so she can take it in um what else do i need to do tomorrow i probably want to go on a walk 
I want to go on a walk when I wake up and like write some goals down or just reflect and like journal and like get my thoughts out and like thank God, worship him before. Not that I can't do that in Barcelona, but I feel like in Barcelona there's going to be quite a lot going on and I really want to ensure that I write something down, talk to God deeply before I go on this trip. So it's like before that i want to ensure that i've already had like my conversation with god and like we're already you know in agreement in agreement in agreement with what we're doing in 2024 so i definitely want to talk to god deeply tomorrow before my trip and just journal write down some goals and like really just you know take some time before the new year because i really don't want to travel without doing that i want to have an everything shower yeah like i want to feel super 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 clean like super clean super super <laughs> super clean um and pack i need to check in and i need to pack I'll probably pack then check in so yeah that is my plan um it's not too much but hopefully it keeps you guys entertained but i've talked enough now it's currently quarter to seven so i'm going to make my way to a shopping center called the white rose shopping center and i'm going to get my brows done at Superdrug, and i'm going to go to boots where i can get my lip gloss and then we're gonna make our way home and sort out whatever i need to sort out so <laughs> Who told me to wear my Crocs without socks? Um, but it's freezing. But oh, let's go. Oh. I'll the day. This is what I'm wearing, guys. I'm wearing my Crocs that my mom gifted me for Christmas, and I love it so, 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 so much. It's some platform Crocs, and I just love them for like my everyday errands. Um, wearing this some any top from Zara that I got years ago, my PLT trench, my Zara mini study bag, and yeah, yeah, it is cold like it is so cold. Oh, okay, it's nice and warm inside the center. <laughs> Hi, oh, can I get my eyebrows on, please? Thank you. And then my seat went to get them gone. It's so cold. Yeah, that looks great. Thank you. Did you say you don't take cash? Is that only card? Just only card. Okay, no problem. Whilst I'm here in Superdrug, I might as well see if they have the my lip gloss from NYX. No, thank you. Have you got a point oh, scan? Yeah. Um, no. Do you want me to scan a few seed at the point? No, it's okay, thank you. Sorry, it's not that. No worries. It's 13, 15 change. Thank you. Would you like to be mine, please? Oh, um, Buddha! I don't even know what shade to go for. So I want, I know I definitely want the 
travel size. So this is the shade I currently have, which is the Kanafa. Now I don't know whether to go for the blondie or the banana bread. This is the banana bread. I don't know. Which one do I go for? This is the Kanafa. And this is the blondie. I think I might go for the blondie, you know, because it's looking like it's not that light up compared to the shade I already have. But this one's a bit more... This one's light, like. Yeah, I think I might go with blondie. I'm gonna try blondie. Hi, you all right? Can I have... Do you do the travel sets? Travel sets? No, not the I'm sure you have the, like the mini. We have the mini, so we just don't have them in this store. Oh, what store do you have um, them in? The mini Trinity. We, don't oh. have them in we only have the four sizes here. Okay. Yeah. And how much is, oh, is it? 34, 34, yeah. Are you able to check whether they have it in stock for me at least, Trinity? Thank you. <sighs> Guys, so they don't have the powder in stock. They don't even have the little travel size mini ones that I was looking for. So because they didn't have that, I was like, okay, might as well just get, might as well just get the big one. They don't even have the big one. And it's like, mm. now I have to go into the city centre. I'm probably going to have to do that tomorrow. It is cold. Y'all, it is cold. I don't want to go all the way into town and I'm going to have to walk bears. Oh, I have to walk bears. It's currently eight, yeah. I don't know whether I should just go home and try again tomorrow or that I should just go buy it. But I do need to go into town tomorrow anyway to pick up my dress from the market, but I just don't want to walk that much tomorrow either. I just want to be in and out to get my dress. The other boots in town, I can't go to because they're closed, so I'm going to have to go tomorrow. Yeah. That's unfortunate, but at least I've got my bottle gloss. I was I was more unsure about the bottle gloss than I was about the loose powder. Um, but at least I got the bottle gloss and I'll try again tomorrow for the loose powder. But now, yummy boy. I don't like answer. I don't even know if that's Spanish, but do you get guys I just got home. So I'm gonna eat, chill, and then I'm gonna I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm tired. I didn't say that I was gonna say Shut it! Shut it! Is that your coat on the door? And I'll think about it. You're too ugly to be in the camera. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. oh my gosh. Shut up. Ah! Hi. Hey, tell him, tell him, Nandy, say slum dog. No. See? <laughs> guys, no, guys, please, please. This is very unnecessary right now. Why are you galloping? Because he's busy. Look how skinny he's galloping. You have to gallop. Yeah, look. Much easier, let's go. Amy. Bye. Guys, they're gagging to be in my vlog. I don't know what's wrong with these vlogs. <laughs> Just gagging for some camera time, for some screen time. Get a life. You get a life. Like you get a life. Like you get a life. You always get a life for real. Everything, you're looking crazy on camera, babe. Mm -hmm. Okay, bye. Wait. Yeah, finally sat down. Enough of being a house girl. Now I'm just gonna focus on myself. Anyways, let me enjoy my food. Let me take these retainers out, give my thanks, and eat my food. Sorry if this is not like an aesthetically pleasing holiday prep vlog because I can't. I live in a house with six other people. An extra two are still here. Stuff is just not gonna be aesthetic. I'm a house girl, I live at home. My family are annoying, <laughs> loud. <laughs> 
so sorry guys, all right? This ain't no Aaliyah Spice, but it's definitely Sebastiana Joyce, so. Father Lord, thank you so much for this meal. Thank you for my life. I pray that you bless this food and bless the hands that made it. Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here and welcome to the title. We're gonna be talking about digital planning. I'm too fast. It is in, of course, just keep on watching. So before we get too far into it, let's just start with the basics. What is digital planning? It is exactly what it sounds like. It is and we're doing it digitally. So let's just kind of start on why journaling and planning is so important starting with journaling and how it can be really beneficial for you number one it's a sh guys it's actually been a minute since i last spoke to you guys it's now 11 30 like what am i doing in my life like i was literally laid in bed playing a game <laughs> playing a farm game <laughs> i need to get live um but I'm gonna jump in the shower gonna do some depilation hair removal I'm gonna wash my hair, gonna scrub myself nice and clean. I'm just gonna feel good, but I just wanted to show you guys the products that I got from Plant Made. Oh my gosh, this angle is really ugly. Should we do this angle? I feel like this angle is also ugly. Maybe it's just my lips that are looking dry. Hello. Hello. Mm. I know we're on holiday, but this is not like we're in Asia or Caribbean where we're not, <laughs> you know, exhausting. Gotta catch a fly. But yeah, I want to show you guys the products that I got. So I got this clear bag from Amazon. It didn't come with the order. So I got soap, conditioner, which are like soap bars, which is something I've never seen before. I've never seen like a shampoo or a conditioner in the form of like a bar, like a soap bar. Crazy. This is the conditioner. I don't have the packet to read out the ingredients and in them things. And it smells too good. Yeah, this smells amazing. And I got these. One already came with the shampoo, but I bought the other one for my conditioner to go in there. And then this is the shampoo. Your smell very herbally. It's still a lovely smell. It's just very herbal. Herb. Um so i told you guys i bought a bundle in it so in the bundle it came this massaging scalp massager my head actually needs it because i ain't touched my head in a minute i ain't touched my scalp in a minute like i neglect my hair so so much and i really want to change that that's why i actually bought this bundle because i really want to get into a routine of taking care of my hair i used to be really good at it but something happened i'm just i just don't care about my hair these days and it's been like this for a minute like i just don't be caring and that's not cute i actually need to take it if you lot saw what was you're gonna see in a second it's actually atrocious got this product which i believe is a moisturizer or like a butter for the hair it's called soil and it looks like this smells lovely this is actually getting me excited about washing my hair like who would have thought I don't like wash day. This is a derma roller, which is like for massaging the scalp. But I don't really think I'll be using this. No, this is, oh, this is the derma roller cleaner. And then this is the derma roller. Again, this was all part of the bundle. It looks like this. I don't know if you guys can see. My lips are dry, god damn. This is some kind of scalp massager as well. And this promotes some kind of hair growth chat. I don't know, it's very prickly. And then the first one I saw is the cleaner for this. So I'm going to probably use this after I've like oiled my scalp. Next, I got myself some oils. So I got the inches, which strengthens, grows, and mends. Drizzle. This is like a hydrating, moisturizing spritz kind of thing. Hydrates, moisturizes, and softens. There we go. This camera I'm focusing, they do not go together. And then this was a bonus product as well, which is Drizzle. They're both called Drizzle. How come we've got two Drizzles? Hydrate, moisturize, and soften. This is with a burst of cit citrus. Yeah, those are the things I got, so I'm like super excited to now wash my hair. 
but first i obviously have to take out the hair i'm going to put on my which uh, this is crazy <laughs> I'm first gonna put on some hair removal cream and then take it out so that the, the cream can settle in and take away those hairs and then I'm gonna jump in the shower to wash my hair so yeah <laughs> I just put it in some like little twists I'm sure you saw <laughs> it looks so crazy anyways um, I'm tired y'all but I'm gonna go put my wig in conditioner and leave it overnight in some warm hot water sorry for the hecticness this is the reality of my life and like my reality like this is just what it is again it's not your usual aesthetic you know holiday prep but here we are. I hope you're enjoying it and I will see you tomorrow. Ciao. Good morning guys. Um, it is Saturday the 30th of December and it is 30, 30? 10 minutes to 2 o'clock. I actually woke up at 1 and then I was just sat in the toilet for a long time. I should have been out to go collect my dress that I told you guys was getting fitted, my New Year's dress, so I'm going to go collect that now. I then need to go to Boots and get my loose setting powder. I need to figure out which Boots has it in stock because I'm not about to be doing the run around. Then I need to come home. I've got an appointment at half two for my lashes. Let me even just check that's the correct time. Yeah, 2.30, lash appointment. My auntie still needs to do my hair. I'm just gonna check now um where the availability is for the huda setting powder only least trinity has this this is crazy the fact that i have to drive to least trinity is crazy like that's like center of town and it's like i don't want to be doing all that walking but hey dominoes let's listen to some worship god of abraham you're the god of covenants and faithful promises Time and time again, you have proven, you do just what you say. It's given I don't have time to try on my dress, I'm just gonna have to, 
um, get the dress and leave and go straight to buy the powder because it's already 10 past 2. My lash appointment is at half past 2, so I won't even have time to go home. I need to go straight to the appointment. And the traffic is mad here in town, like it's just so crazy. So I'm just gonna have to pick up the dress and go. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Who do you think you are? Like everyone's waiting in the queue and you're here trying to push in. Don't do that. Like traffic's crazy. No, don't play with me. Trying to push in the queue, like get out of here. I thought I had plenty of time. Mm -mm. An absolute nightmare everywhere. Like look at the queue to get into John Lewis parking. It's never that serious. Why are we all out at the same time? Go home. I just tried to go park my car quickly at one of these like at one of the streets next to the location that I'm going and it's decked out now I'm coming here and it's decked out I need to message the lady because I'm gonna be late it's already quarter past two my appointments are half two I still need to pick up the things by the things oh, she's gonna try to charge me Hello, you okay? I'm just here to collect my dress. I forgot my card, is it okay? It's um greyish dress. Yeah. No, it's fine, I'm in a rush. So smaller. Okay. Keeping no extra fabric inside. Okay, that's yeah. great. Thank you so much, yeah. <sighs> I hate these town. <laughs> Hi, can someone give me a hand, please? Yeah, what do you need help I need a powder for the Hidu Beauty. Uh, what powder is it? The Blondie Loose Powder. We have a lot. We've been low in quite a big one. Sorry, I checked the stock and it said you had it in stock. Do you have a Beauty Advantage? No. Thank you, appreciate it. And now you get some ones that keep breaking and that. These are Yeah. It'd be one of the New Yorkers that be expensive. Oh, got three pounds of stuff. There you go. Thank you, madam. Thank you. I haven't even checked the time because it's oh, literally I'm none of my business. I just need to get to the car and drive there. But thank God I've got everything that I needed. The powder, the comb, my dress. Guys, we're three minutes to tend to and Thank God to that man that just let me go through her paying ticket because, I don't know, I lost my ticket and I called them and I was like, I lost my ticket, they weren't really, um, I don't know if they could find me, I don't know, but they ain't charged me, so. I told I was going to be 10, 15 minutes late, it is literally three minutes to, I think I should message her again because, oh, I'm going to tell her I'm still in traffic. Hey guys, so I'm arrived at the, at the live studio after being 30 minutes late i've apologized all that i can and she's so understanding um so i'm here with ista yeah, ista and it's called lux lashes leeds lux lashes and it's in wortley leeds so come check her out i'll show you guys obviously the after of my lashes you know i've had my lashes done before but i never liked them because it's like i feel like my eyes are like really difficult to like because it's kind of small and like i like a cat eye effect yeah. so I never tend to like my lashes, but I'm going on holiday tomorrow. Okay. So hopefully <laughs> it all goes well and you do a great job, which I'm sure you will because I've seen your work yes. and it actually looks really good. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you were going to show me the difference between like fluffy or curly ones compared to these ones. Yes. So this is the look I'm going for. Yeah, that looks so good. So. This looks curly, so you don't, this is not curly, is this not the curly one? Mm. Yeah, it looks okay. okay. Okay, just a little bit curlier yeah. then. Just yeah. a little bit curlier. And can you make sure it's got a little bit of a cat eye yeah. effect? Yeah. So it goes yeah. like longer towards the end, yeah? Yeah. Thank you. Do you want them more lifting or elongating? 
what's, what's the difference? <laughs> so lifting is mm -hmm. one is very lifted here, yeah. elongating one is just elongating that. Lifted. Lifted. Yeah, okay. I want it more lifted, yeah. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Okay. I'll show you guys the after then when she's done all of it. So catch you guys soon. Wish me luck. Adios. I've just finished with my lashes. It is currently 10 to 6. So probably spent nearly three hours in there. But I think I'm quite happy with my lashes. I'm gonna wait till I get home so I can really look at them. But so far, so good. Like I don't have any like complaints. I think I like them. I think I like them. Um, but I need to go home. I feel like the service was so good. Like I was 30 minutes late, 30 minutes late, and she was still so lovely, like proper, like you know, understanding. Like I love that. She wasn't passive aggressive or anything. Like she was so nice, um, even though she had every reason to be. But she was lovely. Service, like she was. She told me my eye shape, which is almond. She was like asking me the lengths that I want, the type of curls that I want. She was asking me where I actually want the lengths, like, because I wanted like a cat eye look. I've never been asked before. I've always told Lash Techs that I want a cat eye look and they never seem to know what a cat eye look looks like. So she was like, oh, where do you want, you know, your lengths? So I was like shorter here from the middle towards my inner, shorter than middle and then longer. And she understood that perfectly. She also asked me about like um like the end of some lashes are thicker than the other so she was asking me whether I wanted like a more feathered look or like more of a voluminous look. I just think she was very thorough like she was very thorough asked me all the right questions and you know I really appreciate that because where I've been previously no and she had a great playlist on like I don't know whether it's because I'm black that she put on like an Afrobeat black UK type of music but I was in that chair I was snoozing snoring even but my ears were still listening to the tunes and I loved it and she put me onto this song well she I, I doubt she knew the songs well it was just like a YouTube playlist and I really enjoyed it it's called Ngozi by Crayon and Aya Aya Star so I'm gonna listen to that now on my way home. So thank you, Icy. Really enjoyed that. And it was 75, 75 quid. Lashes are so expensive. This is not a, this is, this is a special occasion thing, you know? really like pulled everything that I had in me it is quarter past one in the morning I think the last time I spoke to you guys gotcha, last time I spoke to you guys I had just left my lash appointment I got home like I said life is tough living in your mama house is tough like your plans don't really go to plans like everything is just all over the place there's noise there's I thought my day was gonna go a lot smoother than I anticipated. Um, but anyways, here we are now. My auntie's just finished doing my braids. So now I'm gonna pack. <laughs> now I'm gonna pack, relax, and have my deep, intimate time with God, get my resolutions straight, and like, you know, enter the year well. Um, 
and yeah my brother is gonna take us to the airport at like 6 6 30 um so yeah that's the plan i told rachel to come here at six but she can't come here for, she has to come here for five I don't even know what I'm doing for real. I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't even know what I'm doing. Everything is all over the place. But maybe, let me start with my big luggage. I'm gonna need to charge my phone. Let me start putting on my worship from now. Then I bought this bag from Amazon. It's a cabin bag that goes underneath your seat. Um, because Ryanair and all these airlines are playing, they're being crazy. Like they're being so crazy with like luggage allowance. You now have to pay for a 10 kg cabin bag we obviously have to pay for a check-in bag and things are just so expensive like it's crazy so i bought this bag so i can put all my clothes in This is my 10 kg check-in. This is my cabin small bag. This is my airport fit. So I've got some Jordans, these tracksuit set from Nike, Barboy and ASOS, my neck pillow. Currently 3.45 a.m. Can you imagine? I've only just finished getting my shit together. <laughs> so um, I think I showed you guys earlier, but this is my airport fit. So I've got my cabin bag and my check-in bag. When I get up, I'm just gonna wash myself quickly, put on the fit and be out the door. Um, but I just don't even think there's even any point me sleeping right now. I'm just gonna continue listening to my worship songs. I'm going to pray, journal, write down my goals and my prayers for the new year. I pray that God speaks to me and I just pray that this year is a blessing for us all in whatever capacity that may be. Um, so yeah, I'm just really gonna try and tap into that for the last couple of hours that I have before we get moving again. My hair comb broke on me, like all of a sudden, it literally like was not turning on. I was so confused, um, I was so angry even, cause like, why, why now? My tripod, now my hot comb, like, come on, like, 
please give me a break. So my friends are bringing it. I'm gonna use a comb to flatten this because I feel like it looks so crazy. I actually don't think I showed you guys my eyebrows, but they be eating. Eyebrows eating. Lashes per. Do you guys like the lashes? I'm. I'm a fan. <laughs> so that's it for the holiday prep, guys. I'm so sorry for the hecticness of this video. Like I said, my life is not aesthetically pleasing. Like I live at home with my mum, my siblings, families over all the time. Like there's a lot going on a lot of the time. So sorry if this video wasn't, you know, the aesthetics that you were looking for, but this is real. This is me. And I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to give me a thumbs up if you did. Share, like, comment, subscribe, all of that good stuff. And of course, I will catch you in the next one, which should be the vloggy, vloggy, vlog, the little travel vlog. So make sure to come back and I'll catch you soon. Ciao, Zim.